What's up, gang? I just want to start this video off by saying I did not cop the Yeezys, bruh. Oh my, I had a video planned and I just don't want to post it because I waited three and a half hours. Three and a half hours. I didn't get the first raffle. I didn't win no raffles. I entered about eight. I did not enter. I did not win not one raffle. So I stayed for the second raffle. I waited three and a half hours and I did not win. Not no size. I was going to get any size I could then trade for my size or resell it or do whatever I had to do. But no, I couldn't get any size because people were being greedy. People were being stupid. Man, if anybody out there wants to hook me up with a size nine and a half or 10 easy, all white V2 cream or any other V easy, just hit me up my DM. That'll be down in the description below. Oh my God, okay. But anyway, as you guys seen by the title, this is the video that you guys have been asking me for the most. How to lace your Jordan 11s, as you can see. My 11s are not on the boxes right now. They're actually where uh, I'm gonna be shooting the video at. So thank you guys for watching in advance. Like, comment, subscribe, share my channel. Let's get to 10K. You already know we're on our way up to 10K. Let's just get there. So I will be showing you guys in this video how to lace your Jordan 11s from lows to highs. Uh, and I will be showing you guys how they look on feet, how I lace them how I think they look best laced and yeah if you guys like it like I said give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new I'm foreign boy the guy who grew up on what she had let's get into the video man all right gang let's get into the first way out of tire Jordan 11s but there's one problem I don't have a shoe oh wait all right well here it is all right so first way to tie your shoe right here the loose just loosed up and no tie at all just put the strings through there that's the first way I'm gonna show you guys. So let's just get into it. All right, so when you first buy the shoe, it comes something looking like this. So it's all tightened up and it has a knot right there. So what you wanna do is, even if it's not like that, so you just wanna take that apart, right? Right, just take it apart and loosen it up all the way. Just loosen it up. Just keep loosening it. And then what you wanna do is, this is like, this is gonna be quick and easy ways to do it because I don't really tie my sh my Jordan 11s in a certain type of way. I just make it loose and it looks really good. So, so what you want to do is put the laces through the lace holder that way and make it about that length coming down on both sides and then just pull it. Just pull it until it looks good. And this is basically how it's supposed to look when it comes out. All right. Like I said, these are all gonna be pretty quick. Uh, it's only gonna take you about two minutes to do each and every single one of these. I have four ways, so yeah, moving on to the second one. All right, so moving on to the second one, as you guys can see, it's basically like the other one a little bit, but instead of it coming down that way, you just tie a little knot. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. All right, so like I said, I don't know how to do the, an actual factory lace, but this is how it should come. Something looking like this when you first buy the shoe. So what you wanna do, if it's not even dead stock, I'm gonna just show you guys how to do it from scratch. So what you wanna do is just take it like this, grab your tooth from right here, and you can do it this way, or you can do it this way. But for this specific one, I, want, I like to put it this way, and then tie your knot in the beginning. So at the start, just tie your knot like this. Make it a little bit long. So make sure your knot's already pre-tied. Oh, snap. All right. Okay, boom, there. And then what you want to do after that is just take it like that, make sure it looks like that, and then just loosen it all the way down. And like I said, every single one of these should not take you that long, and it only took me a couple, like maybe two minutes. That's number two. And now moving on to number three, which will actually be with the Jordan 11 mid. All right, so this is the first way to do it with the Jordan 11 mid. Obviously, this one is for the jean types that just sit on top of your shoes. The jeans that are like kind of skinnier or tapered that just sit there. And so just basically loose, just like this one right here. Just like this one, but in the mid form. I still haven't worn these. I still haven't worn my 13s, my ones, or these. I'm still looking, like waiting for that, probably for like the summer, but so what you wanna do is, you know, if it's DS, just undes it really quick. If you plan on wearing it, undo the knot. And then what you wanna do off bat, grab them, twist them, and put them down through the lace holders. Just like that. And just like that. 
that low. You want it that low. You don't want to put it this way because it'll look like ant, like antlers type things. Like so, you don't want to do it like that because then it'll look like antlers. So you have to put it this way, and then after that, just loosen it all the way down. And like I already told you guys, all these should only take you about two minutes each to lace each one, each style. Kind of pat it down, and then. You should be good and then at the end of the video I, sh I will be showing you guys how all of these look on feet so and they all look fire so that's number three I'm moving on to number four so as you guys can see this is still lace type three but from lace type three what you want to do is take the ones from the top out and don't do anything with the other strings right off bat you want to tie it in a bow just like that and then turn it turn it over right kind of tighten it a little bit and then boom and then now you want to kind of fix the other strings to make it look good and so basically it'll come out looking like this and this is for the jeans that sit don't sit on top but go over your jeans kind of cuffed and you guys will see that what I'm talking about on the on feet at the end of each one of these styles so yeah, that's just my four type of ways to lace your Jordan 11s. Like I said, I don't tie my shoes real tight like Kai Somar does. He does. He ties his shoes really tight with every shoe he wears. I honestly can't do that because number one, it creases your shoes really bad. Even worse than having your shoe loose. Number two, your ankles can't breathe and your shoes, your feet end up being really hot and maybe even sweaty if you have athlete foot, which I don't. But honestly if you're if your shoe fits well just kind of rock it kind of loose just so that it's more comfortable unless it's like a Jordan 1 then that I could see people wearing it kind of tight but if it's like a half a size big or you know maybe a full size big I don't know why you'll be wearing a full size big but then you know tying it tight would probably be the best option but these are just my four tips my four ways to tie your 11s now let's get into the on feet
All right, that's all for this video, guys. Thank you all for watching this video. If you guys liked the video, make sure you guys leave a like down below. Also, subscribe if you haven't already. Share my channel and comment what you guys liked about the video. Also, comment what you guys want to see in the future on my channel. I know I'm going to be doing more vlogs, more things other than sneakers. I know my channel is not all about sneakers, but that's all I've been getting lately, and that's all I've been really doing lately. I haven't been out the house, really. So more videos on the way make sure you guys subscribe for more content go follow my instagram go add me on snapchat those will both be in the description down below also if you guys have some yeezys for sale we want to hook me up not no crazy prices for the white ones because y'all know them ain't going for too much make sure you guys hit me up in the dms if you guys have any size nine and a half or ten but i'm about to get out of here man thank you all for watching if that helped you guys make sure to give it a like and it's been your boy phone boy man and i'm out okay.